I'm Stacey Ray, I'm a veterinarian and um, with my partner Matt we own the Monto Vet Group in the North Burnett region of Queensland. We operate multiple mixed practices that service the beef industry, mostly commercial producers, seed stock producers and some family run feedlots. Pestivirus is actually endemic in the North Burnett and the Calide Valley. So at our practice, um, we would see a couple of cases every month of Pestivirus throughout the year, year in, year out, and at least one case, like a wreck case of a client every year. I think Pestivirus is really underestimated by cattle producers and the MLA produced a report that showed that Pestivirus was the second most critical disease in, in Australia or costly disease in Australia and from my perspective in, in my client base I definitely see that. I think it's underestimated because it is a complicated disease, it's complex to understand. It shows up with mucosal disease production losses, reproduction losses, so it does take a long time to understand the disease and understand the impact on the herd. So I think it does quite often fly under the radar. When commercial producers um, look, are looking to purchase cattle and to introduce them to their herd, there's huge biosecurity risks always. And it's not just pestivirus, it, it can be parasites, it can be weeds. But definitely with pestivirus, it's really important when producers are wanting to introduce cattle into their herd that they understand what the disease status is uh, of their herd and that they're aware of what the disease status or the risk is of the cattle that they're purchasing in. So I would normally suggest that we do serology testing of the animals that they do have on their property so that they're aware of, of what their disease status is and they can put together a vaccination plan. And then the same with the animals that they're buying in and I try and encourage my clients to buy immune ready animals and to buy animals that are PI free or have been PI tested. If they're not able to do that then I think it's a good idea to have a biosecurity plan in place and if they do that then they can work out a quarantine protocol where the testing of those animals can be done before they're actually joined with their own cattle. The simplest and most effective way to manage pestivirus in my opinion is just to vaccinate. It's important to work with your veterinarian to understand the status of your herd and then to put in place a vaccination program. The programs are really simple, really effective and um, can be tailored to suit your production needs. PestiGuard is a really simple vaccine. It's an inactivated vaccine, which means it's very safe to, to use. It's safe to use on pregnant females and it requires a two shot start in the first year. So normally I would encourage my clients to have that conversation with us around their program and we would get the heifers vaccinated twice in the first year before they joined with the bull and then annually. Yeah, the biggest thing I've learned about pestivirus over the years is uh, not to ignore it to understand what it is, go and talk to your vet, get an understanding of the immune status of your herd, put in place a, a vaccination program, prevent the disease and um, make sure you're not the one that, that suffers the loss.